All right, hey guys. Um, I actually wanted to talk about digital marketing, right? Um, what is that? Well, technically speaking, it's just a, a new way, or not even a new way. It's just making connections through an online channel where you advertise your goods and services to an audience. And where that audience is now is mostly online. But since even the COVID, COVID-19, most persons don't aren't really on the road or going to business places and stuff like that. Most businesses aren't even optimized for the future or for digital. And it's crazy because I would have studied a course or I would have done, I did my major in digital media production. And what that highlighted was just the way the world was changing in, into a, a digital future, if you will. And that was, I finished that course, that, 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 that discipline in 2017, I think. And that was like a three year program. So imagine you're getting a glimpse of what the future is going to be like and you're trying to tell people who can't necessarily see what that future is, let alone make certain connections to what you're saying. Hey, you should, you should have a website. What? What's a website? But now, because of COVID, what you have happening is there's a rush to try to set up an online presence. There's a lot of misunderstanding with how these things work. And when people do get on and they're not necessarily getting the traction or they decide to run ads then they think they're gonna see insane results and that's gonna translate to people buying the products and that's not necessarily the case and that could be that's also far from the truth you do have some unicorns that pop up and actually do that but that's because there's a product market fit what's a product market fit well a product market fit is essentially when a product or service meets the demands and the needs of the user. So you have a lot of brands out there that are making products that the users don't even want. It doesn't solve a problem for them. They just think that product is gonna work because of their feeling. But that's the point. Digital marketing offers opportunity for you to actually capture data, analyze data, see how people react to data, and make changes in the back end or adjustments to how you produce your content for your SEO. But this is a lot of stuff to talk about. Um, it's, it's, it goes really deep. It's like a deep ocean, but I'm gonna be making more videos like this to share about, you know, those tips on digital marketing, Instagram, Facebook. Um, I'm actually a practitioner, so I'm not afraid to get into the platforms and experiment and make notes and show you my process. So. I'm launching a vlog, not a vlog, I'm launching, I'm launching a blog very soon that's going to go into more details and different aspects of all of this and I just have a wealth of knowledge that I've accumulated from my major, from my work experience and just constant studying of this space. So from that, I'm just going to be sharing as much information to help you, your friends, your businesses grow online. So just look out for that and if you want to any if you want me to talk about anything special, just let me know and I'll do that.